Hello everyone, this is Magic from Advantech. I'm glad to have this opportunity to introduce our DFSI partner, SmartSoft CEO, Jesse. Hi everyone, I'm Jesse. It's very great to be here today to meet you with Magic. Yes, uh, actually that in this year we see lots of AI opportunities coming. We co-work with our partner to realize this. And also we face lots of difficulties to realize this. Why I say that? We see more and more opportunities coming. But for this opportunity, it's not easy to realize in the field. There's lots of considerations actually. For example, like environmental consideration. How do you integrate everything together? So if we want to realize this AI in the field, that means like we need to co-work with lots of partners. For Advantech, we define four major partners to realize AI technology in the field. First one is our DFSI. Just like I said, DFSI is the most important to realize AI in the age. DFSI in Advantech, we define that it's domain focused SI, which means like for these kind of applications, for domain focused SI, they know what's the major expertise in these kind of applications. So they know the pain point. And then they also understand how to integrate everything together. So SmartSoft is the most important our DFSI for IEM. Of course, we also work with other kind of domain Fox SI, like Smart City. Smart City is also a very important opportunity for the AI adoption. For example, like traffic management, traffic monitoring, car type, and car place uh, recognitions. And another one is about Cloud Edge. Cloud Edge, which means like we see more and more opportunities, need very lots of computing power in the field, but they also need a real-time response in the field. So we need to work with cloud vendors. Cloud vendors are so-called here, like Advantage Wise Pass, and also we work with like Microsoft Azure and also AWS Greengrass. The third partner we want to work with together is ASIC vendors and also accelerated computing vendors. The most important vendor we work together is NVIDIA. Yeah. Okay, I think SmartSoft also work with NVIDIA very closely. It's very important GPU technology to realize AI in the field. And like another vendor like Intel, also Huawei this kind of vendor we work together. The fourth we partner we work together is Fox Channel Partners. Why do we need to work with Fox Channel Partners? Because for lots of ISV vendors, they want to work with uh, like Advantech, but they don't know how to start this. They're not easy to get into get contact with Advantech. Okay, so we work with a focus partner in the in the re different regions. When we work with them, we have lots of training course, we have seminar, we have marketing events. That's kind of an event we can generate lots of uh, opportunity leads, and also they can get contact with Advantech, and also we can lead them to work with our DFS partners. That's why I said when we realize HAI in the field, we co-work with whole ego partner together and also we integrate everything together. So today, uh, we invite our major DFSI SmartSoft to talk about it. So Jesse, I have a question to ask you. Yeah. When we realize this kind of AI in the field, how do you work with them? And how do, what major technology from your company to do this? Okay. Can you share to us? Sure. Uh, uh, let me uh, briefly introduce what we are doing, what SmartSoft is doing. Uh, we are an automation uh, solution provider. We provide different uh, kind of solutions to different needs of, different needs of customers. That means we can provide the uh, algorithm license uh, for, the, for customers. And also we can provide the software uh, to customer. They can use our software to, to edit, to do the second development according to their need. And also we can provide uh, some, we call it, uh, modulized uh, subsistence either with some uh, control system inside and with our software and, uh, and our, our algorithms. So customers, they can uh, use these modules subsystems uh, uh, quickly uh, connect with their major system to, to make a more complicated system, machine machineries. And the, 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 the last one, we can also provide a total solution, a machinery, a customized machinery according to the customer's need. 
So we can provide uh, the uh, very wide coverage solution to customers. Uh, how we can do this is that we got our own software platform. We call it uh, SmartSeq. It's a simple modular, modular automation sequencer. We make uh, every functions in the machine in, in the automation machinery to uh, to to a module. Like we got a sequence module, we got a vision and AI module, we got a robot robot con robot arm control modules and the motor control modules and sensor DIO modules. We got different software modules combined together and provide a very easy to use GUI uh, for the customers. And also we can use it uh, by ourselves. So customers, they can uh, make uh, automation project very quickly based on our platform. And also we can make uh, customize very quickly for customer who, who, who they, they don't have the ability, ability to, to make the automations. So uh, by combining these different modules, we can have a lot of different applications. Like we can uh, make uh, um, AOI and AI uh, defect inspection machines. We can do vision guide robot to do pick and place. We also can integrate instrument uh, testing. We can do AOI, AI, and testing together. And we can do use robot to do assembly. There's uh, so many kinds of different uh, combinations application in, in the fact in the manufacturing. So uh, the most important we also use AI Navy to do the deep learning model training very quickly. We focus at the defect. Uh, it is a hugely uh, increase the accuracy and the, the, the speed to find a defect uh, based on AI Navy models. And the most important that we can use just a application, application engineer. They don't need any deep learning technologies background. They can use AI Navy very quickly to change the model by just collecting data and uh, label it. You can use uh, AI Navy to start the training. And after the training is done, we can deploy it into SmartSeq and to do all kinds of combination. So that is why we can we have a, a very successful deploy hundreds of systems, AI and AOI systems, into production lines at different customer size and different production lines. And a lot of customer or people ask me, how do we make it? Because uh, we heard about that it is very difficult to lend in AI into a real case. So uh, like for example, we, we, uh, we use, we deploy a lot of AI and AOI solutions. But how to successfully deploy one uh, AOI uh, plus AI solution into customer site? It is not just AI. You need domain expert to understand what the customer's pain point is. The domain expert can be customer themselves, or you need partner or yourselves. I mean, that's uh, customer usually told, uh, tell you their pain point, mm -hmm. but it's just the tip of the iceberg. It is, they don't tell you the other pain point uh, underneath the waters. So that means uh, what uh, the consistent, consistence of a machinery, you need uh, hardware design. You need people to understand how to do the hardware design for the customers. You need to do the software development. It is not, it is not just AI. You need a, a total solution software. It may be you need to upload data up to a cloud, you need to generate report, and maybe you need to consider efficiency of the software because the customer will ask, ask the uh, inspection time, mm -hmm. uh, the most uh, crit critical part. And uh, the operator interface, or we call it GUI, how to uh, provide to the customer or the operator to uh, easily to, to use the software. And the other important part is the vision optical uh, struck, uh, construction. Uh, what kind of light, uh, industrial lighting you need to choose? What mm -hmm. kind of camera mm -hmm. lens to get the correct images for you to find a defect? And then it is AI. So you need at least four different part uh, people or professional expertise mm -hmm. to help you to build these machines. So it is not possible to do everything by yourself. Mm -hmm. That's why we need partners. Like we are a software company. We don't have any uh, hardware 
a design uh, engineer or or, or proficient. Mm -hmm. So we that's why we have a, a lot of partners like Advantech. Mm -hmm. Advantech has a, a wide range and very flexible IoT hardware. So we can uh, choose very quick, and also they they have very uh, common driver drivers for us. So we can use very uh, less efforts to integrate all these hardware into our platform. So we can uh, choose different options for customers uh, according to their needs uh, very quickly uh, based on advantage hardware platforms. And also we have uh, the lighting uh, company in Japan, it, it is CCS. So they can help us. We, so we also have our, our uh, optical uh, lab. So we can provide the testing uh, provide a suggestion to the customer how to do the lighting and camera and lens uh, sele uh, selections. Also, we co work, that just Mitch said, we co work very closely with uh, the, the media. So, uh, our model is uh, we, we can transfer into uh, running on TSRT with a very more efficient and faster and more accurate <coughs> models. And, like, we also work with Microsoft. So, our, some of our uh, solutions can go up to the cloud, mm. uh, providing some SaaS, SaaS services to the customers. So uh, we also have uh, like Econ, it is a Taiwanese uh, machine builder. They can help us to the hardware design to provide a total solution for our customers. Also like we co-work with uh, National Instruments, we mm. can provide testing uh, functions for the customer. So uh, it is very flexible because now it, uh, the customer needs needs get more and more complicated. Mm -hmm. So it is not possible to do everything by yourself, I just mentioned. So you, we should focus uh, on our core value, mm -hmm. the strength we are. We, put, we should put our resources, our time, our engineer into the one you are good at. Mm -hmm. And the rest of the part, we should uh, uh, leverage a partner's strengths that you can, you can uh, get all the subsystems together very quickly, so you can save your time, your cost, and shorten your time to market. Mm -hmm. That's the most important part, I think, in lending AI. You need to not just see the tip of the iceberg. You need to understand the pain point underneath the waters. Thank you, Jesse. I think you mentioned very important part is that for the AI lending, it's not just like one dot to another dot. It's more like a net. Okay, so you can connect different parts of expertise together and integrate them and realize in the field. Yeah. I think that's also important information for all of us because when we want to do that in different regions, in different fields, in different applications, that means like you need to look for your major partner in your region. And what major partner you want to work together, you need to know what's your expertise and what the major demand for requirements. Okay, just like Jesse mentioned, for lighting, you need to find, find the most, most professional one for the lighting applications. For integration, for automation control, you need to find the most professional in your field. And also, if you don't have this kind of partner, how do you start this? You can work with Advantech, or you can also leverage our resources to work with different BFSI in your field. So that's what we so-called eco-partner system. It's not just a single dot. So today, I would like to thank you, Jesse, sharing for this kind of uh, applications you, and your experience. And also, in the following section, we will talk more and more about this. So we will invite different regions of ourselves and also our partners to share their experience and also example how do they really land in AI in different regions, different application fields. Thank you very much. Thank you, Jesse. Thank you, Magic.